Uploading images to your course through MyPCC Course Tools is a simple process. You may want to upload images just simply to decorate your home page, or to spark a creative thought for a writing class, or simply to share visual course content. The first step would be to select the class in which you want to upload the image to. Under Content Tools, which is where you manage most of the items that you're able to have control over for your course, we would click on Manage Photos. The separate areas that are displayed here, Submitted Photos, um, students can submit photos that would not necessarily be available to other students, but you could decide whether or not you wanted to reveal them, and that will come clear later. Active photos are those which students would have access to. Inactive photos would be those that maybe later in the term you want to reveal to students but want to upload them now and you can simply activate it when you want students to have access. So our first step in uploading an image would be to go to post a new photo. A screen appears where we will pick our status submitted, active, or inactive. We'll make this photo active. Next we're going to browse to the file that we want to upload. Select it. Its address is included. We'll put in a title and we can also put in any type of content that you would like to describe to the, for the picture. And we simply post. Click OK. As you can see, where we once had nothing under active photos, we now have the photo that we've uploaded. As mentioned earlier, you can shift these by checking this and putting it in the inactive file. As you can see, it is now located down here. Students will not have access. If a student clicks on photos, it indicates photos are not available. We'll go back to Manage Photos, click and make it active. Now when a student clicks on Photos, the image is available. And they can either click on View Photo or the title and it will display the image in full size along with the content which you submitted. You can also post photos on your home page, and where we do that is we manage our home page. Here you can feature a photo, feature links, and feature top five top links. So what we're going to do is click Edit to feature a photo on our home page. We click the photo that we want. You can have several listed here, and we'll set the photo. Click OK. Now when we go to the home page, the photo that we've selected is now listed there. And as mentioned earlier, it jazzes up the page. Anything that might appeal to your students, you can have listed here.